Oh, yes, it is. And I really am in quite a terrific bait. You have been in there for 15 days. In the toilet for 15 days. I mean, what can a man do by himself in the toilet for 15 days? You haven't got a magazine in there, have you? If you have, you just give it a really good wipe. And you put that magazine underneath the floorboards where I keep all my secret things. Oh, my God. It's not my special homemade one, is it? The one with Claire Short apparently giving head to Raggy Omar <laughs> and taking it up the ass from Shuri Blair with a strap on. <laughs> that silence means something. Right, that's it, Eddie. I'm going to break this door down and come in there. I mean it. Here I come. Oh, Christ! I think I've broken my arm. Try turning the handle. <laughs> I'm not going to fall for that one, Eddie. is here, back where he belongs, in the toilet. <laughs> Fifteen days without the sweet smack of lavatory seat on poor Richie's bottom have come to an end. Oh, bliss. Let oceans of pleasure surround and engulf poor Richie's little arsehole right now. <laughs> Where's the bog? Good grief! Where is the bog? Eddie. What? In the name of Satan's fetid foreskin, <laughs> have you been doing to the toilet? Where is the toilet? How in God's name is a young gentleman supposed to tip his skip in a place like this? <laughs> Eddie, reveal yourself. Press the button. What? Press the button. What button? The one marked do not press. <laughs> okay. I last went to the lavatory. No? Well, I do. What the fuck are you asking me for, then? <laughs> it's sarcasm! I'm just trying to get across how angry I am at not being allowed to use the lavatory for the last 15 days. Why don't you just say you're very angry at not being allowed to use the lavatory for 15 days? Because I am a polite, well-brought-up, English, middle-class person. <laughs> That's why I'm the ordinary here. God! <laughs> 
People like me are nailed to the cross of civilization and forced to pretend to be nice, even when confronted by amoeba-brained byproducts of animal baggery like you. Well, that's not a very nice thing to say. Oh, feeling intellectually challenged, are we? What are you going to do? Resort to violence? Leave it to me. I have experience in this field. That's a very good and surprisingly popular idea. No, 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 I'm just being intellectual. Imagine I'm Tony Blair. Right. Well, get this, Tony. to talk to you about that. I'll talk about it now. Say things like, it's over there. Here's a lot of bog roll. It's out of order. Don't kick me about any. I'm sitting on top of a human Hiroshima. <laughs> Where is the lavatory? The lavatory is no more. <laughs> what? What? Well, what have you been using? I have been using the evacuator. The evacuator? The Storm Force Plus 5 Industrial Grade Evacuator Mark 3, to give it its full title. It's not strictly for lavatorial use, but ooh, it does the job. <laughs> what does it actually do? Well, this little baby works on the same principles as a Hoover. Huh. <laughs> Except that this one can clean your whole house in 30 seconds flat. Simply by removing the entire contents. <laughs> Everything. Unsightly household stains, walls, carpets. It's all conveniently removed and converted into black matter. All right! Top-notch creativity! <laughs> Let's give it a whirl. Right. Take your trousers down. Oh. 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 Oh, fucking, oh. I'm not going to take my trousers off in front of you. Well, would you like to use the modesty screen? <laughs> Crikey, a modesty screen. God, Eddie, this is so 21st century, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Ah, 
Right? Oh, oh, and uh, pants down. Pants coming down.